Rust to Lina Queda Likida, Quanidism Council of Ife. Ah, we were in no Banange, Avali Kuana, Babati, Balamisano, to have a Zimba at Sobo de Sokuba Mukutuguno. Council Uganda, several bad doctor was made up so many. A rabbit to a lady said, I told the Kuva no good doctor. Echo Sobo Sam Muchimukobe at a rose that had a doctor. Teach young. That's on a light note. Namu is Savana and Gavari Kubona, Navari Kuli so good is Navari Ku streaming. A chin to Chiru Kora Rokuno, chin to Chikuino, Chirimu have been to Binji. I can so ke in Chirate to individual level. You will go moon to Oja wa soma, what I need cocola, why no curaculana. Annie, I didn't know Vunanziwa or Kulaculania. You will mean or no Vunanziwa or Kulaculania. Ngoli kukola emine moe jo, jo lo uzanti idha kusobo lo kutola yo. Uh, Olizo kulima mwanyi, walima duma, walima emi nituwe mindi. Wasobo lo kubituonda wafu na esente wawa nga wetu sako yu nituwe yenda. Kale wogera gana nyanaba ntuwa mani iti tituwa gayaga mungkola. Uh, Eri ya wanda ya wakola nga wakubanafu, ya wanda nga wakola inu. We are going to go moon to Aga Igawaire, or Okubakoze. Ah, uh, will you do a moon to only what I took at Ya will ranga Yandifunyemu, Kakasi, and Takandi, a Katemu, a soul okula kula in Noxinga Valley Kula Kurana. It seemed to a choke and chide at a kunsi. Ah, I some and those and to 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 cover the limit of our geta to underway and those we better express this one in English. To be able to understand it better, I hope uh, the, the the viewers uh, uh, cut across uh, languages and uh, I let me use English for the time being. Uh, what I've been saying is that we as individuals are responsible for our own growth. We are able to to pro, to proceed. Uh, or to, what I've been saying, we're able to grow because. We do something. We, you go out and produce a product. If you feel that you want to produce more, you may go out and borrow money. And this is true of uh, countries. Now, Uganda, like many other developing countries, has had a major challenge. First of all, we went through the slave trade period. It, it, this history is important for us to put a context. This slave trade period removed our dignity as Africans. So we, we, you will find invariably Africans fear whites because of that dominance. When slave trade ended, we went into colonialism. The colonial period was a period where uh, the colonial countries came to take two things. One is our uh, minerals and two, whatever we produced in terms of raw materials, uh, which they went and processed. But they also came back and sold to us. But they made it in such a way that whatever they sold to us, we were unable to pay them fully. So they have to give us loans to be able to buy from them. The colonial period ended and we got into the neo-colonial neo -colonial period, where now the colonial masters are no longer there, but we have there are multilateral institutions like World Bank, IMF, United Nations and other institutions which have perpetuated the same situation we had during the colonial period. So uh, uh, countries like Uganda have got minerals and we have a ministry which licenses people to take out these minerals and we are paid a, a royalty out of those minerals which they take away. Now, is it our problem? Partly yes, but partly no. It's our problem because we have not developed science to be able to, exp to use these minerals. For instance, take the uranium in, uh, in Niger. Uh, Niger uranium is, is mined by France, and it is said that that uranium powers 53% of homes in, in France. But the, the Nigers are poor, and they don't, they don't understand the usage of, of, uh, of uranium. So 
Today, what is happening in the developing countries is that we have to borrow money from uh, international multilateral institutions to be able to fund what we are doing. Now, th there's this case like this. Um, right now, Uganda imports goods worth $6 billion. We export goods worth $2 billion. Our Chayo money gives us an additional $1 billion. So we have a deficit of $3 billion. We must borrow this money from IMF. But what are we importing? What are we importing? We're importing goods produced in the developed countries. What are we exporting? We're exporting coffee which is, and other raw materials. We're not adding value. This is where President Seven has been saying, can we add value so that our export earnings are much higher? So we don't have to borrow as much. Now, um, uh, we even had this, this coffee meeting recently. You know, Uganda uh, grows coffee. I think last year we earned $800 million. And uh, Germany, uh, through uh, the multinational company, multinational companies, uh, has earnings from coffee of $4 to $8 billion. Now, so that value belongs to Uganda or belongs to the countries that grow coffee. This is what President Seven is trying to say. That no, let us add value so that we can get some better value out of this coffee. Right, so we have to borrow because we don't, we, we are not able to sell with value. So we have a deficit. We continue borrowing and borrowing and borrowing. Now and again, they forgive us some of the loans. Now, those of you who understand economics, you know that banks create credit. Uh, this is a simple level economics lesson. Well, how do they create credit? You go open up an account and they lend, they lend you money. Not that they have it. You, in the process of paying back, the banks are creating credit. The banks are generating money. So it's possible for them to even forgive you the money or part of the money, as long as you are paying back the interest. So what is happening right now is that we have loans from IMF to support our imports. We have loans from the World Bank to support our infrastructure development and other things. And the question is, do we need it? Yes, we need the money. We need the money because we don't have it. We need the money because we are not exporting goods which have got value addition. We, uh, we need it because we have signed agreements with World Trade Center, World, World, World Trade Organization, which do not favor us. We need this money because they've taken away all our minerals. Uh, look at Congo. So what is going to happen? There are several things that may happen. One, a very serious case where Uganda is going to see inflation. Uh, we're going to see inflation because we, 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 we can't afford to, 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 to pay for our imports. We, are going to, we may get into a case, a situation like Zimbabwe did. If the Western countries gang up against you, you have a problem. So um, the, the, the Uganda may find itself in a situation where we have an inflationary pressure in the economy. We cannot control it and the prices will shoot through the roof. Uh, of course, the currency has already started losing values, depreciating, uh, because the demand for the Uganda shilling is going to go, to, is going to go down. So we will have a problem here that we don't have, uh, w w for us to be able to even import, we need more Uganda shillings, which we don't have. So uh, on the other hand, Uganda realizing that you can no longer get loans must be able, we must work very, very hard. So Ugandans must be conscious to know that we must work hard to be able to get the benefits of uh, trading or having something to sell. Um, if we don't have anything to sell, then of course our import bill will be even be bigger. If we are blocked from exporting, our import bill will be bigger. So Uganda must reduce it on its imports and be, Uganda must attempt to produce more and export more but it will not export to the Western countries. Uganda can only export to uh, you know, the region. But can we cooperate in the region? Can we sell maize to, to Kenya? Can we sell maize to, to Tanzania? Are we able to exchange goods 
with one another. This is where the concept of Pan-Africanism becomes very important, that we should be able to agree as African countries to sell to one another. That's very important in, in this journey which we are going to face. If the, the other option is something that is happening, the emergence of China as a superpower, the Russian-Ukrainian war may be the silver lining that we need as African countries. Uh, if China can take our coffee, which is value added, then we may be able to earn more and import more. Besides, after all, we're importing largely most of the goods from China. So we need those trade pacts with China to be able to export value added items to China and other countries. BRICS, which is happening right now, may also be an avenue which may help Uganda in the current circumstances. Uh, there, there are good things and bad things that may happen. Uh, the, 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 the global, the, the changing global geopolitics, uh, which is now going to the side of China and Russia and Asian countries, may favor developing countries emerging out of the situation that we are in. Otherwise, the current arguments we have with Western countries, take a case of Niger, take a case of the Francophone countries. They have signed agreements with France, uh, which France controls their currency. Now, that you can never develop in such a situation. So, yes, uh, President Museveni has come out very strongly to say, yes, we can develop without those loans. It's, tr it's true. But we may be sabotaged. We may, we may have problems where uh, the country is, you know, the, 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 the country's trade ca cannot be executed because of constraints imposed by Western countries. So, we're in a tricky situation. It may be an opportunity to break through. Uh, it may be, uh, we may get in worse situation, but I believe that what is taking place, we have to work harder, we need the leadership to, to guide us, we, various economists need to come out and discuss this thing, we need to come out and uh, advise government. requested me that uh, the audience that we have that and uh, the topic that we are discussing maybe use the foreign language of those people who are failing to fund us <laughs> so that they can change their, <laughs> their thoughts but of course <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> professor to Karina and we shall be getting back to him. Can't handle the work so the liberation is that professor Dufine. I look in Gida, you know, what we produce and what we export. Ains of Kuba and gas twin PFA. Singat Banga to Tawa Mani. Can Uganda still live to Akuban to fund ourselves? On the small budget that we have, basing on our ex exports and imports, what we sell and what we bring in. Mm. 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 Mo kute sakuwa professor mm. ato ile yo history mm. tutandika tutia slave trade mm. tuingira tutia colonial phase mm. tuingira tutia mnio colonialism mm. kubanga tuafuno wetu tu waze mm. nge wanga mm. na afrika na mawanga manji mo asia ni pacific aye Independence yet to have na Yairala Kuanga World Bank ni IMF Navy Tongo Levy Vindi Multinationals ni new face of colonialism. 
So, wetu batu likuwebu za ndikan Uganda live without World Bank funding. Hmm. Tu batu likuwebu za ndikan Uganda stop neocolonialism in Uganda. Because nzenda chidi ingirida mjiopolitiko angu. Mu hmm. ideal Yes, we can. Mm. But then reality. I am reality. <laughs> In the current situation. In the current situation. And that's what I To communication, ya World Bank, ya Kobe, but it could disengage in the future funding. Mm. Future funding, meaning it right now, for this half year remaining, about one year, and we want to get a new financial year. Likely, this budget, a young man, twenty twenty three, twenty twenty four, to work with us. A young man would have affected mm. fundamentally mm. by this decision. I had to the now fifty two trillion budget. Obu se ata na bubili. Obu mm. wetu edo buta bali kolo isa tenga tuwa bubaze. Mm. <laughs> ata na bubili. Mm. Ife nge wanga na tubise mo revenue ya ife. Mm. Tusobola oku generate nga ku obu tabali ka obu obu se abili na butan. Mm. Which means tulina deficit ya 27 trillion mm. for the budget. Yeah. Bano abasoma ebibalo bino ebya economics ba professor Tiang ba professor Iswa Valuma by dab kobanti borrowing is good era everybody borrows even living organisms borrow from the environment so borrowing is natural and we must not and it has never been bad that is why even the word exists in the Oza. My diction in the borrowing exists. Niba naba kola credit, debit, balancing a balance sheet, baby. Or is what a borrowing a balance sheet may not balance. But uh, different countries fill up that deficit <coughs> through different means. But the same year, a denda uro. Oku closing a budget deficit today we. Mm. Coincidentally, chizo vanti NC ngoba NC dona 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 diri mu muwa ready ona yona mm. countries. Mm. Bana wake up misiwa chizo tu kuba ayo chizo buta se anga yonsi diwe rai kumi. Doko vanti doti deola. Gadebe sa wden. Enti de de very 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 sustaining. Kwa ngana America no detuwe bomba. Oja wa wulida nga embo zeri wa wakati wa republicans ni democrats ku issue yoko ya wala mm. but wana bet bade ni yetu beti hile ku beti lo wazan to the advocate budget ya ifenge wanga 40% of our budget eja mo debt Service. servicing mm. usasura mabanda both external na domestic mm. but world bank tuidaso katu tujite gere Nti World Bank <coughs> ni number one player mu financial market. And, and for me, when we are analyzing, what do you call analysis ya impact, ya decision ya World Bank? Uh, what do I have to say about history? If I was my history, I don't want to say about when he sneezes. Hmm? <laughs> the whole of uh, Austria shivers. Hmm. Now, when the World Bank we are similar, mm. all the other players are in the financial market. Abagaba grants. Abagaba grants. It is so funny. Abandi Abagola ku international level. Bona be a World Bank. Na IMF. So the other one is their source. It's a conglomerate, a tumble, it's a very intricate mm. financial um, market. Mm. But World Bank, 
Elina advantages. Clones dayo. Tulikuwa risk and excitement. Hmm. Yes, there are new partners, new blocks that we are lobbying or who joining uh, the BRICS that have not yet tested, the, been tested hmm. be, because they are new concepts. They are defiancy concepts. They are trying to defy the economic order. So you call the BRICS a defiancy uh, yeah, yes. concept? Yes. But you call it a dogo. Katubezeku. Hmm. To wonder if we cannot set new paradigm hmm. uh, and, and, uh, and um, dynamics of uh, international finance market. But the World Bank, one advantage there you move why you <laughs> for a country like Uganda, why a decision by World Bank should get us a bit worried. Nti hmm. Bagaba long term financing. Hmm. World Bank Dakwa a facilitate a good race period you are mere cassat. Eh, but the countries like your own and your risk or quo or a quangu. Mkrembezadu are come at ya, will make a maker. At the other end, access of Miaka and at the other two give it. But hey, I'm under the collection. But one, World Bank gives long term. Mm. Secondly, World Bank Elina interest rate it is very cheap. It's so nice. World Bank money is cheap money. Cheaper money, not very cheap, but cheaper money. It is cheaper in paying back. No, the interest rate, because the interest rate at times don't even go beyond one percent. Okay. But the alternative players are mm. mu market AO. Mm. They will not be a very easy alternative for us. Kwanza risk wa kubuza wano professor baadhi na baadhi kukubanti our import export mm. eh mm. to balance inga tutia but we ojo kwa wola mwezi kwanza wali kujawa manerenda wali kwenye daba kuwe ubuka irei kumi ya ida kubuza wali ne ya echa pa uba title ya ya <laughs> title ubo wali na yo love book yeah, yeah, motoka so it will have more international dynamics that import export Uganda to Ziranda Gano to Zira Chapa to Zira Logbook. Our network, our value <laughs> to dynamics say do our two angle will go to a center. We have a world bank. We don't have Kuba, to be kind of yo, that professor that professor work with no idea. Your world bank would also want to give you money because it's a new colonial control tool. Mm. You, you are the bank. Meaning we don't need so much to worry. World Bank so addresses. World Bank addresses that question, the new colonial question. Mm. So, so you're part of and um, ni mood or you debate bullying. Mm. Eh? Mm. What, what the World Bank is doing is simply bullying and blackmail. So we don't need to worry. No, you need to worry. I will tell you, and you need to worry because Jendi corrupt. Do you think they are serious on it? The Ochoko was serious, Shiriao, before we passed the law. Hmm. Hmm. But to cover the direction Jemuli taking is worrying us. Hmm. If you continue in that direction, in what they call human rights, their version of human rights. Okay. Yeah? Hmm. Whether cultures are universal, whether ethics are universal, whether culture mm. is universal, whether what we call human rights and the understanding are of a universal nature is another issue for discussion. Mm. I the issue is to whoever Bakwan blows the, 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 the paper determines the tune. Mm. Eh? Mm. Ye yeah, World Bank eh, to Kobanti in the chain that are human rights. Mm. Eh? Mm. Bona bona ba yamunga rodange. Chemulino kwe tachi? Human rights. human rights. Human rights. You must not get your own definition. Now 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 where the blackmail comes in, nti World Bank is taking a decision. Mm. I tell you kwenda kutegera. Sente divam world bank to be jam sector zen kuruino ngaitan. Mm. Human capital development, omomu ta health, mm. mota education, to add to infrastructure, in Gudo, they were that way to Zimba and so many of those areas of ICT. Mm. 
Yeah? The, the need to you infrastructure fiber extensions mm. uh, digital transformations for us as a country yeah. mm. so the component of the budget of our welfare as a country centered mm. and essential and essential mm. it, and a sporadic decision kwange eno eno decision ya ibetu jeta a sporadic decision mm. tiba tuwa ile wile wetegeka singaba kukoba nti given the decision jemu wako ze ya iteka mumi ya ketanu we are disengaging so we eh? start planning uwe mutandiku planning hai dukiranti bando ba ikono misiba idako ba nti ba atandi seira planning ya national budget yomu waka gure saike uwe ba jitandi seira eh so was it a magic yetu jakola a job closing at the 27 trillion mm. the 51 deficit air financing air budget every immediate mumaka guno mulala and this one throws us into so many things professor balunywa abaire dali kuwa suggestions nti we need to rethink to work hard i there is no hardness yetu jokola a joke answering a withdraw question a immediate very drastic very drastic mm. it, it, it will take us to a dakati leadership yet we know simono a fuke yona deliberate according to the situation according to the situation because what a guarantee of musala bagusaze oba ilofu nanga emitu alata no muezi na kumitu alata anue joko lina kwa supply inge nyama wamuka wabudi wamuka agalete chule vile de nyama abana wabako banze tuinonu wanga mata every morning no wa mata supply inga na umusa lai wabako banti buti buvile wo emitu alata anu tuja kwa emitu alavidi uwenda muende maka uida kuma fosto kuma anti be uwe nyama soka akolechi akoma wo Owa mata lekanga kutunwe kwa omuka rutubalansi nge daya tebuti. Just simba wakatiwe na Professor, uh, Council Deliberation ye ni uh, Professor Balunwa. Council wako mawantu nti. World Bank kabia vaireta amwe sente. They are the key areas. Because when we talk about infrastructure development, when you talk about um, human capital, uh, breaking it to two minutes of health, uh, uh, transport, and agriculture, name it. Do you think we can rethink now drastically like that? And we rearrange ourselves in the way of spending, in the way of living, in the way of making political decisions to fit in the current situation. Okay. Uh, it's okay that I'm going to call Professor Balunyo Kwanti Aliku program. You know? mm. I think it really adds value to the program yeah. and uh, to the listeners. I'm going to call it transition. I think it is very, you know, you cannot live without history. Mm. And this is the biggest mistake that most individuals do. Even when you are, you are, for example, a new manager into an organization, try to go and study what is the history of this organization. Mm. So, Chikuyamba predicting our trends. Mm. So, I think the issue, the, 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 the history of slave trade, it, we need to keep renewing it in our minds. Now, the moment that may, they, they get that mentality out of their minds, we are not going there as slaves. Mm. Otherwise, a younger slave. Mm. But when you are doing it out of ignorance, mm. whatever I am doing, I am doing it in the best interest of my country. developing yeah. I'm not going as a slave. It means you even think about repatriation. But again, when you speak like that, just not to make it a topic, you find mm. how Ugandans leave Uganda. Mm. They go and they are frustrated. Not I don't all of think them. Many that, of is, them. That, is, that is very true, and it's a big debate. 
Uh, but it has a number of factors mm. around it. We can go to discussing. Mm. We shall take a lot of time yes, around let's it. Yes, let's go on the topic. Yes. Mm. Mm. Now, but then, but then, Songa as a council, I get. I think they are very critical. Mm. The World Bank in key issues. Mm. The key sectors actually. What are sectors that face on our? What are transport sector? Uh, 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 infrastructure generally. What are what are industry? Finding what are service sector? Finding what are agricultural sector? Finding. And now industry contributes close to fifty point two percent of our GDP. Uh, I mean, sorry, service sector close to fifty point two percent. Now, what, what is the implication of uh, World Bank withdrawing their funding? Mm. Agriculture, which employs close to 80%, contributes close to 24% of our GDP. Mm. So, what happens when World Bank withdraws? And before you go so, any more further, mm, mm. what bank has been funding these sectors? Has it been funding it 100% that Uganda we don't put any penny? On no, it money? doesn't. I think that question was was clearly elucidated by Council. Mm. But we are Gambia and to in domestic collections. Actually, our our to be precise, our our domestic collections are 20, the, the, the projected collections for this financial year, 29.7 percent. Mm. I mean 29.7 trillion. Mm -hmm. That is over 56. A percent of the budget that is domestic collection. Men of Gambanti to the name sent as a trailer external funding. I don't know, I'm not in your own to that to Gambanti on top of that to call any debt servicing. Cutty, Tosso, the funding a hundred percent, but their contribution it's in their contribution a boosting a local amounty. Nelo fifty six percent get to collectinga. Nelo to sovereign to collectinga. I don't know what I value. Chivana Kubanti or Zimbia and you, Nengo Jaji Komia Kuring Bim. So, what the, their funding does is that it roofs the house into a Jutuno leader, Olavanti and you, Yagua. Meaning Uganda, we can't build one hundred percent. No, we can't. The, 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 that's the basic meaning is that the, 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 the target collection of 29.7 mm. trillions cannot be achieved if, uh, if uh, World Bank withdraws their funding. Mm. It, it, it simply means that the, the contribution by World Bank facilitates the economic activities that lead to the collection of that 29.7 trillion. Just briefly, uh, 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 Ngudo. Mm. But private players, the more contracts, but as well, Muchi, um, solo. A cool way, my local Yitao, a Yama Guzi, a Viva, Maria Zeza, Makulu, Megazi, Bianga. So the, 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 the World Bank funding boosts the economy. Now, so was um, solo, now so good of Gukolachi, or good realizing. So, I mean, the withdrawal doesn't mm. only affect its. In the primary contribution, yes, but also affects our our domestic five times more. <laughs> yes, absolutely, mm. absolutely. Mm. Which man you know in the uh, previous financial year, uh, you are a uh, shooting the less. Yeah, it was it was it twenty two. Yes, twenty two. Yes, it was supposed to. Uh, the, the target was twenty five point. I think yeah. five. Mm. Never 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 collecting the less. But remember, we will go back you one day. Kuluna, tell me, let you are underperforming. Mm. This time, you, you, you will hit the previous target <laughs> plus the new, the, the, new, the, 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 the new task ahead. But if you look at the contribution to the World Bank, you will have to be able to do it. And yet, I want to build a new building to cancel what we in terms of Kon omuda soba world bank aje tuli ne kula gani ya fanya world bank diwatoa bila world bank the main financial globally 
Mm. That was clear well elucidated. He said that you get a conyo. But on top of that, mm. see, World Bank is now in Singa 114. They mm. fugitive. Mm. Then we see, you know, a government technical ne police advice. Mm. On top of on top of Okua send a government technical ne police advice. Na ya te ngo 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 e teki nikone police advisor ujiza kumabali bo mungu ya kanso cha ya gambi enti e gaba e kuwa sente at a low interest on top of e kuwa sente at a low interest e kuwa ne sente e zobre lady the twitter brands on top of that kandida gara kuwa example bo tu wali bo tu wali mu covid ba tu wa milioni dollars bivili 200 million dollars is our economic recovery. We have been making up. Can we have two million dollars? We have gone. Is it two million dollars? Ninety-eight million dollars. It's a low interest credit. Cash is another number. But the one hundred and two is a grant from because World Bank in Nairobi Uganda it's a very complex complex institution within it by the writer IDA the International Development Agency the International Development Agency again I'm young guy again I'm also in Uganda Uganda to have a grant in any kind of grant that grant here the the two of them are called 102 million is given to us we are not supporting the economic recovery yet we are targeting the Two hundred and sixty micro, small, and medium enterprises. But out of those, in Uganda, but two other entities, a mutual ena, but it is led by a bachala. You know what it means to to boost women. So I'm just trying to show you how relevant World Bank is to our economy. But you see, they are in us so much than we need them. We need. We both need each other, but we need them more. So, yeah. the, the, the issue I was uh, uh, echoing the issue of planning. In Kulagana, I have a World Bank, but uh, historically, the government is you know, from 86, 1986. Now, from 1986, that is close to 37 years. Government is not a the mass of the Tulaga, are we going to continue relying on these concessional loans and grants, or do we build the capacity of our economy? Because uh, uh, Abadigaba, they feel to tell us and they will be there giving to us, and we feel like yes, but it still doesn't stop you from it, yes, it still doesn't stop you from planning. It is true, World Bank is not going to close its operations today or tomorrow, but it, it is also very true that Uganda is going to be here for years. Mm -hmm. And, we, and uh, you, you know, when we, when we do a comparison from 86, you'd find that there are many economies that were almost at the same level of development as in your in you. The 60s, GDP, Afena GDP, Asian Tigers, Asian Tiger Cubs, mm -hmm. they were more or less at the same level. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, but when you compare them, the other countries can now come and fund projects here. They are giving us donations. They are, they are, they are lending us, but mm. we are at the same level. So it means the question of planning was not adequately handled. Mm. So that there is that element of sustainability. Mm. One, in terms of human capital development. Single government, that would be just good enough. But they actually don't know what to do and how to do it. Then when you look at the question of industrialization, why don't they don't know what to do? That is a that is a big question. Uh, uh, that's what I'm, I'm saying. Planning the education sector itself has not been extremely supportive. Cut right now, government is focusing or, uh, more on the uh, TVET. But, but it is true, but even the implementation mode mm. uh, has a lot of questions. Mm. Then what we have a mindset, most especially Ugandans, yeah. most of them, when you refer to what you call the Mark Gregor's theory X and Y, most mm. of them are theory X uh, 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 individuals. And they want to be pushed to work. They, 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 they don't have that kind of focused mentality. So as a result, 
you cannot build resilience as an economy. Okay. So what does the what is the implication of World Bank's decision? Mm. One, as uh, now World Bank again a mass on me with the day. Maybe before I go on the implication, just mm. I, I just want to, to, to throw comfort to government. Mm. But one uh see and also so government to get a uh, uh, sexual activities be, uh, between genders uh, individuals of the same gender mm. but in africa now we have over 30 countries is in a, is in an anti-homosexuality act and as you are the bank that, cut the funding from them now that is where i am diving towards mm. we, 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 uh, you know in the east african community between kenya Tulina Burundi, uh, we went out of East African community, Tulina Ethiopia, Tulina, there are many countries. Yes. Mm. All, the, all these over 30 countries have said no mm. to homosexuality. Mm. But, but one thing I can assure you is that most of these countries that have said no to homosexuality are, are still receiving uh, concessional loans and grants from World Bank. When you go to Malaysia, when you go to Asia, most of these Asian, uh, Middle East, I mean, uh, when you go to, yes, when you go to Asian co co countries, most of them have said no to homosexuality, but they are still... Special with Uganda. So that now that is where I'm, I'm heading towards. Hmm. So our government, one, must stick on the values that we uphold as a country. There is no country that does not have values. And the moment we compromise our values, it means we shall not progress <coughs> as an economy. Then the two... Well, our government needs to go into in-depth discussions with World Bank. Because this is not the first time it is, in a whole Katononyo, this is not the first time World Bank is suspending funding. Okay. No, 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 the year 2015, when they were constructing the, the Kamwenge Fort Porto Road, hmm. World Bank are the, uh, 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 the same as constructing uh, 225 kilometers of the road. When the, the implementation had started, uh, NG, uh, civil society organizations and NGOs wrote directly to World Bank that there were acts of sexual harassment in that community. World Bank sent its representatives and they realized that children below the age, girls below the age of, 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 of 18, mm -hmm. most of them were around 13, had been impregnated by the, the contractors, some of the employees of the contractors. Mm -hmm. So World Bank suspended its funding for that road on the project or yes on the project for the project it's suspended and all these issues were harmonized mm. so at the end of the day they reinstated the funding but when the congo one they were constructing a bridge i think it's in the mm. yeah that, that 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 power supply it's, it's actually not a big power supply but what happened world bank had about 100 million dollars never realizing the inconsistencies and suspended but eventually they went into discussions, and what happened? They reinstated the grant. So, what I'm trying to show you is that the suspension is not new. Mm. It has been happening. Mm. But our government needs to go into discussions mm. with World Bank. Okulaba and World Bank understand that these are values that we cherish. Mm. That is one. Then the two World Bank has been a policy advisor, technical and policy advisor to our government mm. and several other governments. So our government must show them that this policy, you know when parliament, the problem is that we look at things at a, in a surface way. When parliament passes a policy, it means that policy came not from parliament. Parliament has 500 and something Ugandans. But all these, each of those individuals represents a constituency. Mm. So it means their consultation is down, mm. and the, the Ugandans generally agreed that these policies are not, I mean, the, the, the policy we are passing is not generally acceptable in the economy. Mm. So while the bank is supposed to have looked at the process, Mm. Was the process generally inclusive? Because the World Bank focuses on, on inclusiveness. Mm. Then two, is this policy generally acceptable? It is generally acceptable in Uganda. So therefore, this is a Uganda policy. This is not a policy that is imposed by you. Because they are focusing on inclusiveness. So, Professor, for you, then, don't see any more fears. You don't, you, don't, you, you, you don't have fears saying that if we go into peaceful talks and detailed talks, the decision might be reversed. No, the, the decision will be reversed. I'm very sure it will be reversed. But the, 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 the issue is that world, uh, our government 
needs to go into negotiations with World Bank. That is extremely important. If the negotiations are with Mashinokuwashino, mm. do this to do no, this. No, those ones have been there. There is no one who gives you a loan and they, they just give it to you free. No, we are going to call and banda. There is no freelance. Yes, <laughs> there is no one who gives you a loan just free. So, lastly, as I conclude, yeah, I, know, as I, go to I know you want to cross room. over. Mm. Some of the possible implications of this suspension, if it is poorly handled. Let's go to Professor Rana before we then we get to the implications. Okay. Uh, Professor Rana, I come back to you. Of course, the discussion here in Kampala Studio is that we must rethink, we must prioritize, and then we must review our budgeting, our expenditure, and of course, some expenditures. Uh, they are politicized and the budgeting in Uganda is a bit politicized and when we are rethinking the cuts they are going to affect those people that are going to rethink do you think the rethinking of our budgeting expenditures and our way of living can be possible in Uganda now yes professor Yes, we have to uh, we have to cut our coat by the size of the cloth. Yes, we have to we have to cut our coat by the size of the cloth. I think what is happening now is that um, uh, the, the, the decision has been taken. Uganda must review its budget. It it, it needs. It needs to see, for instance, the development budget that's coming mainly from World Bank. Uh, what, how do we replace it? Uh, I said that there, there are possible chances of Uganda being funded by the new emerging uh, countries like China, uh, which ha are lending us money already. They've lent us money for a number of roads. Uh, I think the important point for Uganda and indeed African countries is respect. Can our lenders respect us for our rights? And I'm saying that over the years, they haven't. So people like President Museveni who have been bold enough to say, no, I stand by my rights, they need to be respected. And it's very important that African countries come together to be able to say yes, these are our, this is a culture, these are our values, and we need to be respected. So it's, it's not going to be easy. Uganda is going to have a problem as an economy. We're going to have a problem in the short run, possibly if we fail to finish, fix it well, even in the long run. But it's also an opportunity for Uganda to rethink its own economic status. How do you fund the activities that you have? Uh, but very important, whoever comes in, World Bank, BRICS, as long as our exports cannot fetch value, real value, we shall continue to borrow from World Bank and we shall continue to have poverty. So to me, the important point is th there is need for the, the, the international community, and when, whenever you say international community, you talk about Western countries, to respect African culture. And by the way, the religions that we, we, most of us profess are brought from the Western countries. Christianity comes from Western countries. Islam comes from, from, from Arabia. And these, these, these religions do not support homosexuality. So, it may be an opportunity for us to say, yes, we want to uphold our values. You must respect us and give us money. But continuing to give us money when we cannot get value out of what we produce is meaningless. We shall be perpetually in debt. We shall continue to be poor. That's all I can say. Can we look at our minerals? Can we look at our resources here? And we forget them and we say, let us struggle to keep our norms and culture. And we go off their money.
and we keep our minerals here, the, the likes of you say that we look at imports and exports. We need to develop science. If you have no use for uranium, because you've, you're backward in scientifically, those who have use for uranium will come and take away, take it away from you, give you a small reality, and they take value out of it. They, 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 they are taking the gold, they are taking the uranium. All these minerals are going out and all African countries are getting is a small reality. This is value that belongs to this country. The country should benefit from this value. And this is what President Seven is saying. Can we process the things here? Unfortunately, we are backward in science. And because we are backward in science, we, we, we will not be able to, to make use of the minerals. So we must develop science along with business to be able to take advantage of our minerals so that we can also sell them ourselves. You know? Otherwise, they are extracted, they are taken away, and we don't get value. Out of the 10 billion uh, uh, value of, uh, of uh, uh, the, the somebody who has given a license, I think, in Karamoja uh, for, for marble, the, the fellow sold it to somebody else and walked away and walked away the money. Uganda didn't benefit from it. And the government of Uganda, the people of Uganda, are getting, a, I think, 2.5% of the value of, that, of those minerals. So it's, um, uh, it's a difficult situation we are in, but I think to me it's a wake-up call. A wake-up call. Can we fix our science and be able to take advantage of our minerals? Can we put our education sector, education uh, structures in place to be able to take advantage of what you do? Can we produce more? Can we resign our agreements with the Western countries so that we can export more? Yes, the loans are good, they're wonderful, but the, the loans are dangling with a carrot you know, and a stick. The stick has now come, you know. The stick has come, you, you, uh, you don't, you, they don't like this law, bah, they, they, they hit you on the head, you know. So uh, we need to rethink, our government of course must rebudget. Uh, I'm sure even the minister has said uh, they are going to go back to par parliament and possibly take out those loans which the uh, World Bank will not give us. Uh, I believe that those which have been approved would go ahead, but there will be no new ones. So that means that possibly before the, year, the financial year ends, Uganda may not be able to import everything we've been importing. And uh, we need new partners in this case. Uh, Some you'll allow me, uh, as I told you earlier on, I need to, to go uh, because of the visitors I have with me in my house. We shall get more time. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Professor, we shall get more time so that uh, we can lengthen this discussion probably next week. I can soak away now, no, Baum Zemo Katuno, then in the Jacuba Tenga, and the studio one, not to get it. Repercussion in a Didua. My wanga in area Uganda and corruption is part of our brother. Is a, is a citizen in Uganda to the Jacola to talk so Lokubanti, a win to Vino, so Lobby managing. The budget said decide politically, budget said the table, I want to, I want to. No one feels into the Nodo Geraku. Priorities to be the new funding, your sectors, the DD key, and guy funding every bit compromise. You look at agriculture, you look at education, you look at the Minister of Health. What is the fate of Uganda? What does Uganda look like in five or two years from now if the decision stands as it is? Niku uh, For this weekend, I want to... Well, I want to thank you for the program. I want to program Council. I want to thank you for the program. Professor Balunwa. Professor Balunwa is... How uh, can I just summarize everything? I can just, just say that he's a senior citizen and is now a, an economic consultant and, and, and an expert. So uh, we've just had him at the studios day for a day and we want to thank you for your time. Then that Mali is with, uh, of course, there is a lot. We shall try to lengthen this discussion. We are trying to bargain 
Professor Jacob Yenti. Let us talk. Watu wa nesho kumuni ya kunti ya mawanga manjinu. Gata ile miko no kuite kalinu. Wadu banka ya dema. Okuba chiniza kuntoli. And why is Uganda now? But, Kansu, do you see Uganda? Oh, Uganda. At some, point, some moment you said we shall sing the anthem, Oh, Uganda. Do you see the Uganda? Tulemele ku courage and norms life. Tuleke sente DJ. Do you see that Uganda with the current leadership we have? Oh, the money shall compromise our love of our culture and norms and values. Hey, the money I'm talking about. some questions mm. and comparisons. It is a natural answer. Mm. Uh, because uh, when a woman in Uganda over who or Zubo or Kovati, a Guanga, no Buanga wife, a two to full of an Uganda, no Buanga wife. So when over with visible being or Kovati to turn no Buanga to Fune a Pia, yeah, over center. A uh, professor Banua Naka Sibula Aina is Jai Tinzeku, a mutual respect. Mm. Mu Mubia Mateka to in a concept debate as sovereign. Mm. Eh? The Buliwanga the Tongoide. Mm. When Mamuavu. Nani we otuyambo to Gurire Mede hmm. Waka Yen the Animukas Wang and Ava Navange. Hmm. Tichi Hua Luxa Wida Kulamba Namukas Wang. Wangan is in Baris. Aha. Owa Wida Nanzia Owa Nimu Ahuva Tibet Muna. Dining away to have a couple of women, you saying a money. Hm. Eh? Mamma, the man, the kid, 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 the Kubanga vali na magi. Obu kai ga wona wona obu zimbie Western World Europe yona yona. Bovire wa mu Africa. Ezira kuisi edo debate Tigers the top five obaji seven etaibie kukomo. Eh? So vali na iwa ndiri Africa. Mudebo wa kwa kukomo wa ile kongo baji vye. I know I give you which you move back or one hundred years of stealing Congo, Nemo, who said the cast the young lady up to today. Mm. So Africa is Africa. Katunda don't know what I Uganda take. I don't know what Samo against we saw. Got to a WSL. Yes, because this country is a very beautiful country. Mm. And then see. A to a node. Yeah. Kadonde you is a mikonedi. Ebiri. moto iguanga but one for God and my country. Hmm. Kuru akadonda nensi yife. Kubanga rio nava ikirizava kuba chizoko kuba ngani ya de nove de jeba waya kuya dam nika waya mu Uganda. Tesi ulo kuba yali busoga. Ah. When you go, Davali to Davali to go, then I want to leave this. Now you go here, Kundi, Chisoboka. Yeah. I am. I did. If you go there, so. Go there, so. Now, for example, even to be told, you know. Obonanga ku omusada. Eye wola sente. Oku tu alaga ufriend. I want to know who you are coming. 
We baba yo, ba inzo kuba mlala kui kumi. Ei, we tu wobuligi ni domusa do yo, omubala mu amadiz maji. Mbe. So, e wanga nga Uganda, nga about 48% of the budget here if you get water. Mm. Mm? What business do we have giving gifts and donations? Wajia kumikolo Umkule mbeze yasa Muka ya kubaba mbawa ilo Muka ile bisatu Ya kubaba Eh Yadi yele Yadali nganka Limoto nganka Luana Nsiche yo Tanzania Kanjiwe ye isomero Eh Yadi yaba no Bona ba Kukule la kwa nani wano Bona kamba donating Le isomere yindi Bano kamba wengudu Bano eh now, where do you get the luxury to spend borrowed money like that? Where do you get the luxury to spend borrowed money like that? Kusaidi ni kila buko na kaje kadi ya kuchina ndege ya tolola. Uganda no msaada aye wale kuvia. Tidi ya ndugu kubeti fa nani? Ndugu kubeti si? Eti fa nani? So where we are going, Professor? Eti ana ya kubia will have to rethink. We may have to rationalize our expenditure as a country. Walingi la budget yao. The cost of public administration is too high. Hmm. It's a known fact. Twin layers of repetitive and redundant administrative units. Repetitive and redundant administrative units. They are supervisor, you no. say that they are redundant. I'm saying repetitive and redundant because Bakola duplication. Air rolls. Ewe da kwe saanga. O muntu mula la vya kola. Bifanana no le vya kola. Ayo nga bona bona bali uo. Bali political positioning. Bamuwa ilo bukuru. Dole bamuwa ilo bukuru. Bamuwa motoka. So we may have to even rethink. Tuwa bisa ite kali ya regional. Tire government. Tuwa bisa ite kali regional tire government. Mkonstitution. Tuwa jia ku high appetite for micro breaking down of the administrative units at district yali endala to attend ko jitobamo district of this because we want to create jobs echira ku buli district eja ku what nenda district hospital and according to electoral commission before 2025 we shall have more new thirty constituencies so we we as a country are a contradiction Elio chetu wako pa kwa vudania government Oweba ya kubati aidaku kubara bada basta ilo Fena vyo tukulangu wanga Mwara bada ba Elio uoli njiri loti ifabandi Aba maurisi mwa analitiko kusonga dino wako Mwati aye What we say and what we do Nga tibige magana Police de tubisa Nibyo tukula what is the future? What what kind of Uganda do you think? Secondly, have I not called a decision? Eh? Etu yamba. Ba ino kubanga. Ba li redo ufu ne midali ya patriotism. Entu ufu. Because the people who must take decisions that will help Uganda okwa avoiding a shock in a neno because of the World Bank position. So now World Bank, you remember? Hmm. Why, Professor, now we need now very skilled international negotiators. We are just thumping. But we want to We are country. We are independent. And we we no more okurida. I reality that we are in requires high skilled international negotiators. Okujia, okutia, be World Bank. Hmm. Ni Uganda, tulingiri de kuwata the priorities and interests. 
no kujikoba nti obusungu okoze seiza bunji ino oliko ze sano ndo kukubachi kukubansiri okukulaga nti iwe the fundamental human rights say you must do ku ingira ka bina ko rundi mm. eh yeah? is a good right to you i will decision eja kulidinga tu loss of lives ba batano health nti abakazi abajja okufa mu maluwali no because of lack of access eh mm. abantu ba sirimu abajja okuba affected by the withdrawal of funding and the uh, ARVs eh mm. namba ya ibuwe kizibishi jaba chini nene ibuwe 4000 mm. times more than abobu bina mm. eh ababo aba human rights version yo mm. so these are conversations what it means nti funding mu healthcare we na lekera ekitegeza nti omuntu mu kyalo ena wankonge jemva aida kuba forced okutundente eh mm. okusobola okufuna obwida ndabibwa ARVs deetaga oba omukazi okumutwala mu private hospital okuzala because funding in healthcare we nakendera naba kaza abali bazalira obwerere no malu alilo nga babiso meaning the cost of living a job uh -huh. now what does it mean iwe world bank amukuru waife nti the implication of your decision eja kuongera obwavu kubaga akateka no kabaire wo ngana managing economy yo musandono mm. kavamu amata banwa ba addressing the nutrition amata gaba manji batunda ko ebikopo mukaga ba biguzo omuntu owundi bafuna sente de bagula ko omuntu na mafuta bagula ko no twido kuota balia eche gulo ne che bisa no na kuluwa so the economy ecosystem yo na yo na yo na yo na ngente vile eda collapsinga nti the gains World Bank do cause a partner mm. for the 37 for the 60 years you've been around since independence bija kuyuyika ndaiwe osazewe okufula one component of the right eh the, 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 the prominent internet affecting up bona 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 so uh, by the to the point of the bantu bakubanga ba consultant ba professor etiang no the government because in the value of anj eh okutegera anti ngo vire ku chest thumping ni political statement eli tugumya eh bino ole wale o chemical ali oba yali gundi mwogezi wa Saddam Hussein eh ya matizanga bantu dituli ni charge ai nechi zimbe chali ku ngabachiwa ndi watani sochi ku bo muri tv ai ndaliko badi wayi nchaji sadam azira wakola chi wajia yaji okola tinga ku studio wali ku bandi muna bantu ba wambiri wano bali ku no flume ba kugeme ile so we don't want to get in that situation mm. of being convinced to believing in reality mm. and let us rethink let us reprioritize to choose a budget ya ife ai nga we kobye ngandi ku mayiza professor atue Uh, views de abali no buvudanzibwa okuchu save into bino ndi ba main beneficiaries they will be cutting on their own hands so tulikusaba enkembo mu Uganda bitu yambe tuteme ekibira mensa gwa credit ya ime kubanga okute mensa je de dindi ne tujyo tu ya manga economy okusobola okuholdinga shock ya withdraw shock ya muisubiyo lyo so so kumba according to council Uganda You are giving us the repercussion. For me, I stand on a crossroad of feeling in Tivanovali by Nashvali kuenda to negotiating an if nation the horizon they are serious and I fear the future and and another time I have hope for the future. What the repercussion is singa the status quo remains. The status quo will not remain, but uh, most of still going to give repercussions in case it remains. Because uh, definitely, uh, we always for us in academia, we believe a lot in assumptions. I end up with a council, so I'm going to say again. Most especially and most importantly, I want to try to calculate out to launch the issue of the cost-benefit analysis. Because this is I have been talking about this since World Bank wrote uh, their first letter. Uh, uh, cost-benefit analysis. A World Bank elina okutwetaga ifo kujira okujiraga 
singa mu upholding a decision ya imwe chichi chetu ja okuluzinga as a result of, of keeping your decision constant mm. so mejoka suja ba yali kulaga nje abachala abali mmalo aliyo bajja kufa business said that it and this ngo muntu example ja waire yente nga nga internet netan so kujira retinga in camera nga subira anti maybe myaka elinja ku eja ku nja kuba nente yindi mm. aye nga botu bolinga bo, inu mobile anti world bank ina mu contribution di di dakufa oja kuba nanga ne ngudo de bazimba okukonnectinga communities nga di ne ngudo di more less useless because the economic activities and productivity has gone down yeah. so as a result obone nga decision je bakoze to serve a, a simple minority group which we may not even have Mm. Nga, nga, nga era e decision ni e e e e e e e e e e e e affecting the need to get video yona yona so i think we need as government it will get a go cooling it ok first of all cost yama ya kola cost benefit analysis then we may kola cost benefit analysis ya ja into negotiations with with world bank you know world bank e e e e into the field most especially you know economies they say sente data the information so when you go to world bank with data they will listen to you because for them they believe a lot in data mm. so government yet aga oku 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 chilingire in that perspective now uh what is the direct meaning of world bank oku banti ife tigume tigume tutuja kuwa uganda buyambi it's okay it would mean that one uh to jack our professor cha 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 yogere professor barunywa reprioritization we revise the budget but revising a budget to tumulire ebintu world bank abiye bayeri ku funding projects de bayeri ku funding no mukudi tumulira there are two things one to solve or withdraw in some of those projects if they are not really too necessary mm. over to as to as paying for the future mm. then two to is occurring is okufuna alternative funding for those projects now what come to occurring is alternative funding e let ya kufuna impact ya world bank because the council ya kobe ye mu kwandura nti 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 world bank eri kulending at a low rate oli chibona World Bank eri kulendinga I am kulendinga ko World Bank eri kulendinga at close to 1 2% mm. and and more so with a grace period a long grace period a man lenda owundi musi yona yona chata jaka oli chibona so it would mean that one government when a covenant to kujja ku borrowing from these other lenders a jack borrowing at a higher rate mm. meaning that the return on investment e jakuba lo then two chi chi jaku affecting the said that to call some budget as a debt service so this hopes the bank by kuba na don't you can go to asia arab uh, the arab world you have not looked at it we are, you have not assessed the impact hmm. but both and ko assessing the impact Ojakuwa nanti World Bank era era yene ni grants boku wa dobelele I told you previously yeah. a few minutes back nti nti baba wa 200 200 million uh, dollars for post covid recovery let me then professor no no kukobera abatubona the process ya negotiating for a loan er international table to ya kujawa no mu bank central bank au bachi chingo tu ale myaka ji It's a very complex and long process mm. because they have to understand the yeah. position they have to they understand a number of things so still within that period mm. their services edli kuirira amalo ali ya government ya for delivering the services in several other aspects however government is go come no to 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 you send out bonds in the treasury bills or treasury bonds but major bonds They send out treasury bonds in the court to attracting the uh, locals in the in the international firms of credit for bonds the meaning of that still locally it is going to to lead to crowding out yeah mm. the uh, uh, local players are ready to go to market one okufuna okufuna cent baje 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 kusana na interest rates bijire wangu mm. So still it is an impact on 
the economy that government did not very carefully. Now, Bomarecho, government, in terms of building local capacity, uh, Professor Barunyara, I recommend to 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 know the value chain. Now, value chain is to be a gala. We need But we to know the value chain. Already, some of we are constrained because I have been emphasizing that government must focus on more on industrialization. Even when you look at our budget, our budget theme, mm. commercial agriculture, industrialization comes number two. Mm. Then the others follow. But industrialization. When the, 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 the biggest funder of infrastructure development, mm. are you mm. are, are we drawings? What does that mean? It still means that you will not industrialize as targeted. Mm. So government, the model, the most important, the most practical solution is going into sober negotiations with the World Bank. Mm. However, there is also the implied meaning of World Bank's decision. Now, this is the sour bit of this discussion. Mm. The, the government will stay in the Mazima. I am Now, if government, government will resign the machine to Chino, you see what the bank deals with the data. Hmm? Now, government, the Prime Minister can swear out the number of government. We must have done the decision here World Bank. World Bank, check your dollar. Check, check your knowledge. The singer Uganda to give Jacob funding here for any new new projects. One, check your dollar affecting the service delivery. Mm. Which affecting the service delivery? To know your demographics. What are the demographics of Uganda? Uganda is close to seventy percent youths. Now, a mayor already saw as you know. In fact, a very Suicide political question. Yes. Emela Sawazuno, Mbi. Because of a number of shocks, actually, that right now, the, what the World Bank has brought is also part of the shocks. You to the younger COVID, the way to the younger Echea, Echari War, to the Jukan last year, over 200 in Africa, Karamoja, no Kusinga, actually, in some areas, to the younger landslides, Ezari, Ezari, Ebududan, Ezari, Kasese. Kati, kati government is seeing that it is taking the light there. This is what World Bank envisions. The, uh, those Congress members who signed on that letter. They envision that the quality of services is going to deteriorate. Mm. When the quality of services deteriorates, because Uganda is a youthful population, they will, it, it will lead to protests. Mm. Now, when it leads to protests, these protests will continue. And continue and continue, which will lead to the overthrow of the government. Mm -hmm. Now, Kobera, government, you know that it is important for us in academia, we believe a lot in benchmarking. Mm. It is important to benchmark. Boba Nechari Sudan, Checha Sula president was Sudan, he was he had been on, on the throne for 29 years. Echa Musula, just the other increment your price, your wheat. Mm. Wheat. Because they, 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 they consume a lot of megati, yes, very good. Bread, they have been to So, price here, which we are in Nanga, the cost you of bread, megati, no chapati, any na. So, what happened? They protested and the president took it lightly. And eventually, what happened? The president lost uh, his seat as a result of those protests. Now, here, that's what the World Bank envisions. I want to have a Kalakasa. Wapua services, and I don't know, Minister, uh, na we honor the Bomsas Viaricova to young budget to to young more parliament to the ingredient to revising the budget. It is, it is, it is not practical because is most someone of, using World Bank to overthrow Mr. Museven because the opposition has been speaking to the Western world. Stop funding you, government of Uganda, stop funding. And maybe the call of opposition has been heard. Can we think so? It is also a technique. I, I will not say I will not say yes. <laughs> and I will also not say no. But at least as a, as a consultant, I advise government because you see, for us as consultants, you bring everything. You bring a buffet and put it down. Yes, so much the government in alternatives. Nige. Now I tell an government. 
Bumuta to Nuri, or my body, I want to have a singer subject to put to me expressed meaning. Yeah, you call it Dua. Not a Nuri, what is the deep line? Yes. What is not a deep analysis? We call a deep analysis. Naka so over that Gamba one. Do you get up to the other world back away with the drawing? Ne collection is a world back a H money. Your H money going in that data. Do you know you revenue authority? Take up a cohitting attack at Zayo. A rich man you wound in you, Diabana Uganda, but you took away Caracas. A rich man you wound in you, did you so look leading to collapse your government? Do you know what it means? O Musadja Wango Adam Fumbo. Can go example in Yango in you. Nemutaro and Yaka Satu Musaf. Musula, Mena, Muria, Mena, Mutambula, Mena, Mukola, Mena, Bubara, Bacaso, Alexi, Bab Nemutara, almost Then in Avakara, Macha, out of the Bruna Vagamba, Mugazana Gamba, Zenese, Chetus Gaza gave Macabo, what were they to Gaina? Provisa de Venavena, the two, the two, the two in Avant. What does it bring? It's over among if you say every single Russo of Michara Wafa, when you put a banger to Nomsa Jacolici, Afe. At the World Bank, I actually managed when I withdraw my funding when Tambra. Well, you're not again, look for me. Can't wait to see you. Um, not to end this, I know, or Rome, Xabuno, um, to Dark Sabs, I've a bad cool. Yeah, um, it's on that note, we didn't even know who need government here, no, it's more about to bunch about singer. Obu money review, or where get say no one dollar and so that you know. And end up service of Avana Uganda, Avali to Bonacba TV, never to lead the Zap or for a Medenda Uro until let's tighten our belts. Um, by wallets, I mean our spending habits mm. and how, how we appropriate financial decisions where we invest. Mm. Wanga, uh, we need to prepare and be cautious. To end up with Zababa TV, Mukuru and Gavalieku, Ni Tim Yonayo Namuswa, Avali Kukamera, Avali Mundeo, Avadu Batabona Hurido. I to didn't Mubabanji or Funa product, Etuka, Eria Vaboni by Fe. Baba Chavazinga, Governor Nadio Pe, Okuna, Afunvoe, Evianda, Nevianda. Quayanziza, uh, Professor Redovero, Marijiza, Moyogun Covet, can quay a second scene as Saturno Sibri. Moyamurundi. As in an end, Okuazawa, Baba TV, Mavaleno, Okutia, Mama Tubona, Mauriza Programmo. No questions are able to call you and have you no quido who are going to program when no. Ah, no look Marisa, Marisa government in the ah, what no leader poverty line, international poverty line, yes, shifting right now in Kutu, two point one five dollars. So Chimichi meaning anti Avantu Aba 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 and Yukuyamu Waf Banji. So I would encourage government and a very rapid industrialization model. Professor Wasa Valunia, Elunga, Ungenio Kuria, Gabunji Kumodeno. Neo African Development Bank never stakeholders are all on our value by a girl uh, rapid industrialization model. So, we is a government, Gunoma Kanga, Gunomes, in the Avimutan Avimusam, Nanakuba, Muyuke, Oxford, in the co 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 presenting a rapid industrialization model, Masoka, Guavala. We is a government in taking interest in rapid industrialization model, a Jabuyamba bridging, yet to promoting a buy Uganda, build Uganda. Mm. Rapid industrialization model again that we amba oku building a Uganda, oku mm. bridging a Uganda, then a building a Uganda. Because Uganda that's all a cool and to do bridging. Ze. So a uh, gambo yang, whoever in Yongweva did that up Twitter, mm. Yonger Gambo Yang, Kubia Council, or whoever Sa, Avali Mavegawa camera indeed. Now we want to take a more money of relevant program, you know. Thank you so much for joining us from the team, uh, Professor Waruno Atulese in our first hour. Nimwe Avaliwano, uh, Professor Dr. Frank Nabuiso, Tudakuba Tenga in at Pekinga, he thoughts, and many others next week.